arts director and the photography instructor this year. So here at camp we use film cameras which we process ourselves and print ourselves so the campus get a chance to learn something entirely new about photography that they probably haven't done before. We have a full dark room set up here so that they get to experience something that it's pretty hard to get hold of in other places. So we, over the session we spend half of our time in the dark room and half of our time out in camp taking photos. While we're in the dark room we spend time learning how to process film, load film and also print photographs. Hi, I'm Ruby. I'm the um, arts and crafts and jewelry instructor. So in arts and crafts I try to have a good balance of um, well, one activities that are more art related and ones that are more craft related. So we've done like oil pastel, like still life type drawings, but we've also done things like making like paper mache bowls and um, a lot of different kinds of paper mache. You know, crafty things, artsy things, a mix of both. Also, um, different kind of activities that lend themselves to different um, levels, like certain things that you can take really far and get really detailed into, but also stuff that like the younger kids can find manageable. We do stuff that it, uh, makes the color wheel an important um, principle and things like that. And the same thing goes for jewelry. Um, different, like sometimes more like easy, crafty, fun, sometimes more like serious and like let's actually learn this. I think the main thing I over overall try to have is like a wide variety of different options in each class and different like array of things so even if it's not their favorite thing one day like they'll be doing something like, like the next day. Um, classes tend to be pretty structured so free time is the opposite. I just say like I have these materials and whatever you want to make um, you can make and I'll help you if you don't know how to do something or don't know where something is like I'm just here to like tell you how to do certain things that you kind of think of or in class it's like you can think of your own ideas but we do have this curriculum for today and then like usually if they ask me ask to do something totally different in class I say like sure but like let's try this first like let's try the plan first and if you're not liking it or you made one and you're done you can you know go off and do your own thing so I try to give them a good mix of structure and freedom. Hi my name is Nikki I'm the ceramics instructor here at Chimney Corners I actually got my start in ceramics here at Chimney Corners in this very classroom one thing I love about being a ceramics instructor is I get to interact with campers who have all different skill levels. Some campers have parents who do ceramics or other or other have taken classes before, and so they do know how to, for example, like use a wheel, which is something we are so lucky to have here at camp. We have a nice set of uh, ceramic wheels where they can make pots. Um, or they just know generally how clay works and there's also campers who've never even touched clay before and it's really exciting being able to explain to them how and help them learn how you put something together and how clay works because then after you make something out of clay we're also really lucky to have a kiln here so we put, put it in the kiln and then they get to glaze it and then they get to take it home. And so with campers who do get to use the wheel, they get a good sense of how it feels to actually throw on a wheel. Um, we kind of work on them with the basics here because there's not, because there's a lot to learn when it comes to using the wheel and that's always really exciting to watch campers gain that sense of um, confidence when they finally understand something and actually understand how clay and ceramics work because I feel like it seems like magic but it's actually pretty easy, pretty simple and it's a lot of the times just have never had someone explain it to them. And so I think it's really it's really cool watching campers getting that song, that sense of confidence in learning and understanding actually how um, ceramics works. Hi, I'm Nomi. I'm the Firefly and CCN instructor this summer at Chimney. So Firefly and CCN are kind of the camp's news source. So Firefly is the camp newspaper, which has been a tradition at camp since the 1930s. And CCN is Chimney Corners News, the news show, which has been going on for a few years. So at the beginning of each CCN class, campers brainstorm what they think is newsworthy that week and what should be shown to the camp during the news show that gets shown every Sunday in the Yard Center. Campers get to interview a variety of people around camp and it really helps them work on their public speaking skills and also learning how to interact with people during an interview. Firefly is the camp newspaper which comes out once a session and what's really cool is that it comes out on actual newspaper paper. So the campers really get to see their words in an actual newspaper. And 
it is it is something that gets shown to the entire camp, which is a very cool opportunity for them 